As we conclude our holiday gift guide, we turn our attention uh, to some music and some gift-giving ideas for the musician on your list. You've already heard from Avery Burdett, who is playing the, all right, I'll read it, WX11 MIDI Wind Controller. Need I call it all that? What do you call it? Uh, the WX11. Oh, the WX11. Eric Johnson is over here. He's sitting beside your regular routine $9,000 piano. But first, let's hear about the wind controller. How much talent need we have to play that? Um, some basic experience on a woodwind instrument. Any woodwind instrument, saxophone, flute, clarinet. You got that? No. You mean the basic experience? Little, little basic oh, did I experience? understand that? No, I don't have any. Why don't you play a little something for us and tell us what's so unusual about that? Obviously, you can't do both at the same time. You take your pick of the order. Well, we combine the WX11 with the WT11 and we have the wind controller system. And we are uh, literally capable of producing thousands of sounds, uh, not necessarily wind instrument sounds. Oh my goodness. Or we can uh, play any kind of... <laughs> that was amazing. and, and uh, whistles and the keep whole going, nine keep yards. Going, keep going. We, we Don't have, hit all thousand, it, but give us it, why is, it, is it necessary for you to, 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 to blow? I mean, let's face it, that same sound could be created on without On a keyboard blowing, yeah. or, or any other MIDI as, controller. As a musician, though, why do you take special pleasure in Well, the in WX11 is very sensitive to breath pressure and ah. lip pressure on the reed here, so we have expressive capabilities that cannot be realized on can any Can you give us one can you give us one or two more? Uh, a little clarinet. And we have some capabilities of playing um, chords. I'm stunned. We are. We're uh, <laughs> what's the WX11 going to cost me? A little more than 11 bucks, right? Uh, we have the, the controller and the tone generator system is $995 oh, retail. Bargain. <laughs> exactly. About $8,000 less than Eric's piano <laughs> over here. Um, piano gift giving? This isn't your normal piano. Well, uh, its its foundation is a standard, very high quality studio upright piano. But it's these two inches at the top that set it apart from all of What do you have up there? I see keys. That's where the computer and the disk drive mechanism is housed. Oh, so you put your CD in there and act like you're playing the piano. Not a CD, necessarily. No. A, a three and a half inch computer disc. Okay, disc. play a little. Go ahead. Tell. Uh, well, the first, one of the things that really sets this apart, uh, the addition of the computer mechanism allows you to record. My goodness. And this allows pretty instantaneous playback, which we consider to be pretty instant entertainment. You only have to play half the time then. That's right. <laughs> right? If you're at a party. I mean, you play once and leave. That's it. Get, get out. I like that. It's, it's a lot of fun at home. Uh, somebody in the family plays. You know somebody that plays. But it also has a professional use. Very high-level players really value the opportunity to be able to stand back and listen to themselves the play, right? Mm -hmm. it, it has an impact that recording sure. uh, doesn't necessarily Jane is wearing, as you probably noticed, because well, maybe you've, you've been looking what at her Jane hands. Is wearing. Aren't they lovely? Do you have talent with those? Yeah, these are not isotoners. No. Hmm. I mean, they, they would keep you warm on a day such as today, but... <laughs> you know, do I feel a little foolish <laughs> following the performance here, Jane and her gloves? I didn't practice any any tunes to play. Do those come with, with, with um, separate little... There's a little battery there. How come you're not reacting with the same well, I, awe they're, they're, and wonder because that you a, gave to our guests? Well, yours are yours are suitable to the price, I would imagine. Those are, I think, in the in the twenty-five dollar neighborhood, <laughs> <laughs> so to speak. All right, this is in case you don't want to get your your loved one, your little loved one, a uh, set of drums and get moved out of the the neighborhood. Let's see if I can uh, go the wrong way. Oh, I obviously went the wrong way. Oh. Yeah, there are, there are a couple of these on the market, I think, where... Well, you take that Ginger on Baker didn't have anything on me. Really irritate people. Huh? I know, but yeah. then this one will also fit back in your budget. Those, How much? This one? I don't know. I left my notes I'm over there. I'm sorry I asked. Um, no, I'm sorry. Mark, take a look at my notes. And 
You'll look it up in, in just a second. These kinds of things are the reason a lot of musicians are, are basically upset with the computer industry, yes? It's not a matter of replacing musicians. It's enhancing their expressive capabilities. Well, That's the way it should be used. I what you were doing, that... I'm sorry. I <laughs> <laughs> I'll Stop just sit that. here quietly. <laughs> um, go ahead. I'm sorry. You were going to say? I'm not, I don't know how to talk without using my hands. <laughs> well, put them in your sweater or something. Really? I, um, no, I was just saying that I could hear the expressive uh, dimension that, that you had added or subtracted making those decisions. And, and especially with the WX-11 for a wind player to be able to play more than one note at a time, to it play a chord. It does need a new name. It does need a new name. Yeah, WX-11. WX-11 isn't, doesn't do justice to it. Would you like to play a little something as we head towards the commercial, guys? Is there anything you, com you can combine on? Sure. We can. The Disclavier will play a background song, and then Avery can play along with Okay, it. and we'll let the, the studio take the commercial whenever they want to. Thanks, guys. Sure. 